Everyone loves mashed potatoes, but not everyone has mastered how to make them perfectly creamy and fluffy. This dish will become the star of your Thanksgiving table. I'm using a Yukon Gold potato for my mashed potatoes. The medium starch, they're full of flavor, and they make for a perfect fluffy mashed potato. Now with these potatoes, we're actually gonna steam them. As you look at the potatoes, you can see they're all of a similar size. That way, they're gonna cook evenly. We're gonna let these steam for about 20 minutes. Whilst the potatoes are steaming, we're gonna to warm together the butter and the cream. I'm using unsalted butter, that way I can control the salt in the recipe. The reason why we wanna warm this mixture is so it doesn't lock up the potatoes. If we add cold liquids to the warm potatoes, the potatoes will go cool and it will lock up the starch in those potatoes. Using a skewer or a small knife, we're looking to see that it gets no resistance. Now I'm using a potato ricer. Potato ricers are perfect for mashed potatoes. It almost looks like a large garlic press and this will give you the fluffiest light mashed potatoes. If you haven't got a potato ricer, you could use your stand mixer with the paddle attachment. We're gonna season the potatoes with a small amount of salt and some pepper. I'm not gonna add too much seasoning at this stage because I don't want to over season. I can always add some more. So adding that warm mixture to the potatoes and now we're just gonna take a spatula and mix this around. Be sure not to overwork it. What I like to do at this stage is take a taste. Does it need any more salt? Does it need any more pepper? And always remember, guests can add that at the table as well. And we're just gonna chop some chives. It gives it nice color and a wonderful taste. Well, feel free if you want to at home, you could use some parsley or just serve the mashed potatoes as is. But take a look at those potatoes. This is the creamiest, fluffiest, nicest mashed potatoes possibly you'll ever taste.